Hello my lovely Gemini's, how are you loves? I hope everybody's well. Gemini, welcome to your weekend reading. This will be for this weekend as we're moving into another zodiac sign as is a Sag. And also is the opposite sign of you loves. And you are ruled by Mercury, the planet of communication. Jupiter is the planet rule rules the Sagittarius. Other thing here is about be careful of the excesses coming in here or whatever you want to do this weekend because I feel here there is some, some of you Gemini's like it's kind of like I will not say it keep your mouth shut because that's not really sound nicely but it's like be aware what you are saying to people or how you conduct yourself in a conversation because very much speaks about you can be over the border and you might not be mean or you might not be in a bad way communicating, expressing yourself, but the other person or the other party might understand quite the opposite. All right, loves. Let's see here, Gemini, what we have for this weekend ahead and how the energy flows there for you. I'm not sure why. My cards are quite sticky today, even if it's not in a tropical time. But let's see here, Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising Signs, and Venus Signs, what we got for you. And where are we moving? Hangman. Hangman is that energy of... Speaks many times about delays, but many times speaks... I know what I gotta do, but I need more time to make that decision. It's like it's something here in pending. And pending something here, like I gotta take the leap of faith. Should I take this risk or not? Am I be in a favorable position or not? We have Piscean and Aries energy here. But I feel here there is something here you are still holding on. And the Spirit says, yeah, you might not be in a rush or you're not feeling to be in a rush, but it's up to you what you do because there's something new coming up. Four of Cups, Three of Swords, Justice. Eight of Swords, Star, Knight of Wands. Even you are separated here from somebody, you are not moved on or you are not moved on from their energy. You might still dream about them. You might still want them. But more likely, it's not like in a loving way, but more in a passionate way, desirable way. Ace of Swords, Two of Cups, Knight of Pentacles. And it's clear here that the energy between you two is quite different. Also, for some of you, there is new love coming in here, but there is a passionate energy between you and somebody here. And that person is gone. Gemini, that person is gone for real. Yes, they might hurt you. Yes, there might be, you know, unrequired love, but there is a wish still there. And this person might put you even in a third party here. Spirit says, find balance within you. And it's okay to heal. As we have the star, Archangel Gabriel here. And then move forward. Because on your way, there is new love here. And this is soulmate energy coming up. And that could be a Taurus Virgo Capricorn. You, I see here Libra, Aquarius, Sag, and Virgo most likely. But you might deal here with a very attractive person. But that person is not here to settle down. 
and whatever that person been doing it's like for them was not a big deal they don't see a problem in that kind of you might tell them that whatever they do is not quite great but they don't see that because they go by their instincts and that was very much hurting there is coming good love to you for the future but first thing first you need to to balance your emotions and first thing first to take care of you Gemini because I feel here there is still attraction between you and somebody but it's time to to see what's best for me with this Libra energy for others of you you might deal with a Libra or an Aquarius another fellow air sign here but first thing first see as that justice what you are speaking in here Queen of Pentacles it's coming somebody more stable towards you two of Pentacles Page of Pentacles this person is not here to stay just like that they are offering you something stable here Gemini and that could be an earth sign here and you might still like I don't know if it's a good thing for me good energy for me but is somebody who will bring you something stable one more card because they come with with an offer but it seems to me that you are not quite out there or you might feel like you you are not ready why why this two of swords why are you not ready nine of swords is this good for me there's a lot of things here like into your mind that you you can still deal uh, is this love is this true love can i allow new love here and of course you can king of pentacles this could be somebody who can love you for the long term they might have a lot of water but i feel here they come with a good open heart here earth with water but this could be a very good good connection let's see here knight of wands why you are here eight of wands ten of swords and underneath nine of cups again with this fire sign there's a lot of desire and I feel here they will conduct you again so prepare yourself for a talk with this person and it's like they want to come in to be there and to be with you but once you're telling them that you're moving on with somebody they will not feel quite great also if you are not ready to move on from this person this ten of swords might be yours so be careful who you are giving your heart or your time and sometimes you know with hidden blessings you can see that see the truth see the clear truth there what's for me and what's good for me and that's a choice and and wake up call what's their best for me so Gemini choose wisely you need time take your time and look strongly what you've been learned from your past and what you are able to go forward now with but I feel here whoever hurts you 
is this fire sign could have a Korean in the chart could have air in the chart like you and now you you need to find that balance within you and move forward and you need more time please do so could be in your benefit but I feel here in a short time comes somebody new and you must be very wise in that energy love and light Gemini's thank you very much for watching in here and of course we'll see you next time loves namaste